Hello children. So today I will be teaching you the second chapter 1.2 Thief Story. I am your English teacher Mrs. Rachna Chakravarti. So before we start with the chapter I would like to tell you something about the great writer Ruskin Bond. He is a renowned contemporary Indian writer of British descent. His contribution to, in, to children's literature is the hallmark of his works and he has been recognized by the Indian Council for child education for the same. The story here, the thief story, is a lesson that contains realization and forgiveness set against an urban backdrop. A beautiful description of the story is presented by him in this small story, The Thief's Story. First, before we start any story, we should know the characterization. So let us look into the characterization of this chapter, The Thief's Story. Ruskin Bond has basically made use of very less characters in his stories. This small story, The Thief's Story, is also having two main protagonists, Hari Singh, a teenage thief, and Anil, a 25-year-old struggling writer. He has portrayed these two characters in a very, very lively way. Let us see some of the difficult words from the chapter. First, appealing, which means attractive. Then, casually which means in a relaxed way. Then we have the word drizzle, which we all know it is a very light rain. Then the word queer, which means strange. Then we have tuck, to keep safely. Unlined, showing no sign of worry or anxiety. Startled, means alarmed. Now children, there might be other words too. You need to find out the other difficult words and write down the meaning consulting a dictionary for the same. Let us start with the story summary. The story starts when a protagonist, Hari Singh, acquaints himself with a 25-year-old Anil during a wrestling match with the protagonist. Unaware of Hari's motive, Anil employs him as his cook on the condition that he would not pay Hari but would provide him food and accommodation. Anil also promises to teach Hari how to cook how to write his name and also how to write full sentences. In the course of time, Anil's trust towards Hari too grows and he also hands Hari the house keys so that he could go and come as he wishes. Anil taught Hari to read write and cook. He was basically a very good-hearted person. He never thought of the consequences but only wanted to change a person's life. One day, Anil gets home 600 rupees that he had earned for his work. Hari tries to steal it and run away to Lucknow. But something seems to stop him. So he returns back 
and decides to keep the money from where he stole. Anil realizes that Hari attempted to rob him but at the same time acknowledges his change of heart. Without stretching the matter, he simply hands Hari 50 rupees and promises to pay him regularly hereafter. Anil realizes that since money is the cause of all this trouble, so why not give him some cash in hand? And this was the turning point of Hari's life because Anil started giving him some cash in his hand. Hari was very happy because in spite of he doing something wrong, he was not punished, rather he was been given some money in return. So the lesson basically which has been written by Ruskin Bond, the main intention is that it centers on the idea that we should believe in the inherent goodness of the human beings and trust them as it is this trust which can evoke a sense of realization even in the most corrupt of individuals. So instead of making him come under the notice of the police, Anil had tried to change the character of Hari Singh and turn him into a very good person. So this beautiful story tells us that we, if we want, we can change a person completely. I hope children you have all understood the story. Please do read it line wise and if you have any doubt, any difficulty, do go, get back to us. But do study the word meanings properly so that you can understand the deeper meaning of the text. Thank you.